three hip stretches. First one, you lean forward, you're gonna grab that foot, drawing it up, make sure we've got a balance. We're looking to get the stretch on the front here, so we're just gonna squeeze the glute, push through gently, and we're gonna keep the stretch down the front of the thigh, up to the hip, holding that foot in the rear. You might see this one done against the wall, which can help make it easier. But if we're in the middle of nowhere, out in the field, and we want to do this, then obviously using our hand is a nice alternative. From there, we're going to look at the inside, okay? So all I'm going to do is spread my knees in the sort of four-point kneeling position so that my hips are above my knees. And then I'm just going to reach forward with my hands, walk them forward as I push my butt back. And I'm now going to push down with the butt and almost tilt my hips forward and lift the bum to the sky. So I'm presenting it to the sky and feel the stretch as I let my legs slide out. We should be feeling it on the inside of the groin area for this one here. Then the uh, final one is just bringing one foot through the middle. I'll show you this from the front. Looking for around 90 degrees, somewhere between 90 and 45. And we're going to keep our hips square to the floor and we're going to drop that rear leg straight back. So with the hands, drop the rear leg straight back. Weight coming through here, okay, with this front leg fixed. And we're looking to get the stretch around the outside here. But it also comes into the hammies if you're a little bit tight here as well. This stretch can also be done on the raised surface, which actually works really well as well. And then from the side, uh, sorry, from the front, comes through like so, and we lie it down. So it's coming across the body center line here. Okay, and the rear foot drops straight back as I bow forward, allowing the weight to drop straight down through the hips. Again, to bring the stretch where we just said. That's it. Three really nice hip stretches, working glutes. Actually, that one brings in a little bit hammies if we're tight. Adductors. And, and then we had the hip flexor on the front. By bringing that foot up at the rear, elongates the, uh, the rec fem, which makes it a harder stretch. We don't have to bring that foot up to the rear. We can work the hip flexor without doing that, but um, we go a little bit deeper uh, by not bringing that foot up to the rear. Three stretches, have a go.